here we go again, time to continue with Mass Effect 2 and this time let's get inside the Shadow Broker's Slayer. And apparently we have our guest committee already ahead of us. Now the thing is that I'm actually kind of doing this for the second time because something happened in the previous record and uh, my game just crashed and then I, it wouldn't allow me to. It wouldn't allow me to load from the same save file that I was having. Anyways, um, the part here is uh, rather easy, let's be honest. Uh, this is pretty much uh, one of the easiest bosses in the game. So, you die, you die. Die, I said. So it's it's not really that much of an issue because uh, even though I had to do a lot of backtracking, um, this part here is uh, fairly doable, quite fast. Once you know what the hell you are doing, there I stop blocking the way. Oh, I want that rocket guy out. Ah, damn it. Go away. Running low on ammo though. I sure like my sniper rifle. There is some. Any information I can use or anything here? Nope, doesn't look like it. No ammo neither. Damn it. Let's uh, switch for the pistol for a while. Headed toward the prison block and Farron. Oops. Ghost in play. There they are. Oh shit, oh shit, ooh. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Die. Okay, I hope I can get inside now. See if there's any spare ammo, because I will be needing it for the boss. Okay, there is Feron. Get the ammo and that one med kit there. Okay. Then let's bypass this door. Uh, that one. Oop. That one. That's there. That's there. That's there. And here we are. <sighs> Farron. Liara? Hold on. We're getting you out of here. No. Farron. What the hell is the broker trying to do to you? The equipment is sensitive to tampering. This chair plugs into the broker's info network. You have to shut off the power. Pull me out now and my brain cooks. Do you know where we can cut the power? It won't be easy. You'll have to go to Central Operations. Tell us where to go. Central Operations is down the hall. You know the Shadow Broker's waiting for you, right? I'm counting on it. We'll be back for you, Farron. I'll try not to go anywhere. <laughs> oh, really? Watch for bionics. Good 
shooting. And more hallways. Anyone here? Anyone? There's some medkit, but didn't really need it. Anyways, um, here I will actually do this uh, same thing I have meaning to be doing for a very long time. Switch these around. There we go. We even put that somewhere else, but yeah. Once I get uh, something else, I will actually switch it there. Actually, there we go. That's a flashbang, yes. Now let's save here. Hello, Mr. Shadow Broker. <clears throat> we meet finally. You're from the drill. Reckless, even for you, Commander. That bombing on Ilium wasn't exactly subtle. Extreme, but necessary. No, it wasn't. Neither was caging Ferrin for two years. Dr. Tassoni, your interference caused all this. Ferrin betrayed me when he handed you Shepard's body. The Drell is simply paying the price. Be smart. Let Ferrin walk out with us. You won't be walking out at all. You're quite competent for someone with nowhere left to hide. You travel with fascinating companions, Doctor. I'm surprised you brought the quarry and Tassoni. Her supposed leadership on Haystrom got most of her team killed. You're not putting a hand on anyone. It's pointless to challenge me, Asari. I know your every secret while you fumble in the dark. Is that right? You're a Yogg, a pre space flight species quarantined to their homeworld for massacring the Council's first contact teams. This base is older than your planet's discovery. Which probably means you killed the original Shadow Broker 60 years ago, then took over. I'm guessing you were taken from your world by a trophy hunter who wanted a slave. Or a pet. How am I doing? Uh oh, Lyra. I think you've done it. He seems rather huge and beast. God damn. Oh no, not Tali. I think Tali got knocked out there. and projectiles are bouncing off. Oh <laughs> now. And then he has a shield. But then again, she just won't really help you. Did you really think that uh, as a sniper I wouldn't be able to hit you behind it? Oh, come on! 
Get in. No. Oh. Damn it. He didn't fail like this on the first try. Was taking a cover like that there. Now, oh, come on, stop hiding behind covers. There we go. Oh, didn't work. God damn it. If you can get him to bring up that shield again. I've got an idea. Okay, let's do this. Once and for all. I have few sniper in round slip. But it should be more than enough to take you down, bitch. Let's go! Kick some ass. You show him, Liara. That was a flashy escape. <laughs> Is Tali alright? Seems that she is. Procedures. I want a status report on all operations within the next summer day. Shadow Broker, out. Goddess of Oceans, it's you. You... how? Well, everyone who's ever seen him in person is dead, so... You're the new Shadow Broker. Is taking over as the Shadow Broker really a good idea? It was either that or lose everything. His contacts, his trading sources, those will really help us. With the Shadow Broker's information network, I can... I can give you... I can... I'll check the power systems. Ah, oh, poor Farron. Been <laughs> kinda stuck in the chair for two years. Different people. You have your mission, and oh, okay, okay, <laughs> okay. But 
We should focus. Let's see what our options are. And I'm glad that I actually did this again because no I cards or user restrictions. It's like he never anticipated anyone but himself being here. And it's all ours. And um, the thing is that I kinda missed that last uh, quake event there on the previous time. I was waiting for them mm -hmm. Liara to finish and then it was gone already. What kind of information are we talking about? I'm not sure. I'll need to go through his files. Come back later and I'll try to have something useful for you. All I wanted was to rescue Farron, but is it wrong that part of me wants this? With the Shadow Brokers network, I can help you. Maybe I can turn this operation into something better. Don't be a stranger this time. Small chance of that. Come back soon. <laughs> and because I got all the quick time events this time, uh, I missed the previous uh, uh, in the part before. I missed one and I had to do that part again because my last save file was quite, uh, quite a far away. So yeah, yes, I got heavy pistol damage here and some damage protection. So. Not bad, not bad at all. Quite helpful, this DLC. And by far one of my favorites, because it does it really bring a lot more stuff to this game. And also you are finally able to actually be together with Liara again, which you weren't being able to before this DLC was out. Which annoyed the crap out of me, because back then there was... Shepard, it's so good okay, to see you. I'm back here now. But yeah, when I first uh, played this game, I was like so heartbroken when I couldn't be together with Liara anymore. Welcome back, Shadow Broker. What's this? That's the old broker's VI assistant. It's actually been helpful with rebuilding the network. Please let me know if I can organize anything else for you, Shadow Broker. It also thinks anyone in the room is the broker. I'll play around with the settings later. My manual is ready whenever you have a moment. All right. Uh, and well, you cannot believe how happy I was when this uh, DLC was actually originally in introduced. Let's see what's here. Oh. Oh. Oh, oh. Um. Um. Interesting. Race lane. Interesting. <laughs> God. God damn it. Everything is uh, broken. Oh, there is the message chain as well. I remember this one. Anyways, uh, I, I won't be reading this now, I will be reading this off screen. And if you want to read them yourself, I highly suggest that you do work, uh, buy the game and that you buy also the Shadow Broker DLC. It's really good. It's really good. And also I will be taking these, all of them. Uh, now this will actually, they, they might help me in some missions and so on. And uh, give some extra stuff. and so on so this this all all in here is actually quite helpful and you can even use this uh, place as a, a basic base you can do the same things as, as you can see do in your ship and you can also uh, retrain all of your all of your guys in here I think there is new custom armor though anyways let's uh, let's get the weapon upgrades because there is the heavy pistol one and also, once I get that one, I can also get the heavy pistol critical damage, which is really helpful. Now, for armor upgrades, there is damage protection, and also there is some uh, faster... Oh, the fact that I can actually sometimes get fully restored shield once I lose them. Really helpful stuff. Like, really. Let's see... I don't think there is anything else for now, though. Yep. 
And also, council member's mistress has made some unusual purchases lately. She may be expecting to move to a larger mansion. <laughs> Let's uh turn on some music here. And also, there is uh, this uh, video archive thingy. Uh, I won't be showing it all console? now. This is the video surveillance access point. I've queued up the archive footage you requested on your last visit, Shadow Broker. Remember, you can zoom in for more detailed viewing and can pause any time during playback. Now, Aria Talok, Omega. This, uh. Emily Wong, <laughs> Citadel. Fred Mazai, Citadel. All of this is quite interesting and it will be changing every time that you visit this place, but there is only one that I really want to see. Here, this one. Let's zoom in. And let's play it. Do you remember this reporter? Do you remember how annoying she was? I'm not the only one. <laughs> Anyways, um... I will most likely going to check this uh, while off screen, but uh, it's some funny stuff there. Uh, they are quite short, all of those clips, but well worthwhile. Shepard, glad you stopped by. We don't get many visitors. Take it easy. You've been through a lot. You're probably right. I never did say thanks for the rescue. Liara never gave up on you, Farron. I just helped. I'm still amazed Liara came for me. I'll never forget what either of you did. I can log that in the archives for you, sir. <laughs> I see you met the secretary. <laughs> oh, God. Um, I'm actually quite curious about the relationship with Liara. For two years, Liara didn't stop looking for you. You two must have been close. She's a good friend. Better than I deserve. How do you think Liara's doing as the new Shadow Broker? Operations are almost fully recovered after a slight dip in efficiency. Ever since we repaired the network, Liara's been glued to the archives. <laughs> I caught her sleeping at her desk more than once. She's busy, but I think she likes it that way. How did you and Liara both end up looking for my body? Cerberus headhunted me and Liara to steal your body from the Shadow Broker. I was working for the Broker at the time, and he's the one who scraped up your remains in the first place. What turned you against the Shadow Broker? He started working for the Collectors. You weren't their first victim. I am... was an information traitor, not a slaver. Okay. Are you holding up, Baron? I'm... I'll be alright. I wasn't always strapped into that interrogation chair. Drell can mentally escape into old memories. It came in handy on the bad days. How many times did the Shadow Broker hook you up to that contraption? A lot. It gets fuzzy. He made the guards watch, as an example. What will you do now that you're a free man? I want to help Liara rebuild this place. But after that... Your schedule's getting full, sir. Let me sync it to your Omni tool. No thanks, I'm fine. <laughs> Looks like you've made a friend. The drone follows everyone. I don't know why the broker kept it around. I'm a shell for a specialized data processing VI, custom built to your specification, Shadow Broker. It helps coordinate the network's massive information feeds. But it could use a different interface tone. You deemed my default personality sufficient for your needs, Shadow Broker. I wish it would stop calling me that. Take it easy, Baron. Thanks. But now, let's get for the good part. And, by the way, let's hope this won't uh, crash this time. I wonder... Nah, I don't think I will be ever showing what happened. Uh, here before, but le just in case that something goes wrong, I'll save here. Because the last time I actually did this, the game crashed, and when I got actually back from the crashing, uh, well, let's put it this way, I didn't see the good stuff. It just uh, was like nothing had happened. But yep, yeah, this, uh, basically this uh, 
DLC is only way to get back together with uh, Liara in the Mass Effect 2, which is kind of annoying. Let's be honest. But yeah, let's just uh, save here. How are you doing, Liara? I'm a bit overwhelmed, to be honest. The Shadow Broker had more resources than you can imagine. Here, come on over. He had top-level access to the Turian and Asari governments. And more than one Solarian Dalatros traded intel. At least I get to share it with you. Have you found anything useful yet? The Shadow Broker knew about the Reapers. Perhaps that's why he offered to help prove Saren's guilt to the Council. He didn't want Saren to succeed. So, Shadow Broker wasn't completely our enemy before. The Beacon. There's even some data on the Protheans. I think he knew what was coming and was looking for a way to survive. Well, that makes sense. But anyways, I have more in important stuff to talk. Actually... I could ask about this How'd first. You know what the Shadow Broker was? I didn't. I had no idea what to expect when we finally found him. But I researched pre-space flight cultures during some of my Prothean studies. I know a bit about the Yog. There's more on the terminals if you want to look. Hmm. They're a fascinating culture, and a terrifying one. Why was he still looking at Protheans? They gave us the warning in the conduit at Ilos, but we've used those. The Shadow Broker seemed to think there was more out there. Perhaps the Protheans had other plans. Or maybe he was just grasping at anything that offered some hope. I see. How's Farron doing? As well as you'd expect, after two years of intermittent torture. He gonna be okay? I don't know. He wants to work, so I'm letting him help. Maybe it takes his mind off it. So... You and Farron are just friends. I believe you made it clear that I was, as you humans say, taken. <laughs> you know, I didn't come down here just to talk about data. Look, about the kiss. We just finished the fight. I miss you, but it's been two years. I don't want to put pressure on you. I've got fond memories of the last time you put pressure on me. <laughs> so do I. Why don't you come to the Normandy for drinks? I'd like that. And let's Good. just go now. Get your things and come on up. Okay, thanks. Why I'll wait right for there. it? Just give me a minute. Oh yeah. Just let's hope this game won't crash this time. Because this is the exact moment where my game crashed previously. And here we go. Did you enjoy the tour? Yes, it's a beautiful ship. And I ran into Joker. He seemed happy to see me. Although he did ask if you and I would be acting out scenes from some vid called Vanya. Of course he did. Oh boy. I also spoke with Dr. Chalkwaz. I'm glad she's doing well. I brought you something. It took some digging, but... I recovered your tags. Oh, well. I thought I'd never see these again. You can't get back everything you lose, but sometimes you get lucky. Yeah, that was the plan. How are you actually doing, Shepard? I mean, really. Not what you tell your squad to keep morale up. I'm okay. Really. It's been rough, but we'll get it done. You've certainly made a good start, even if those idiots on the council won't admit it. There wouldn't be a man, woman, or child left on Horizon, if not for you. I saved some of them. Not enough. And the Collectors will keep hitting colonies until I stop them. So you'll stop them. And here I thought it'd be difficult. 
You'll get the job done. You always do. I just don't know what comes next. So tell me what you want. If this all ends tomorrow, what happens to us? I don't know. Marriage, old age, and a lot of little blue children. You just say these things. Stop being so awkward. Goddess, you were dead. I got better. This time, but you're going to leave again. When your team is ready, you'll leap through the Omega-4 relay. Don't you worry. I will always I come back. I two years mourning you. So if we're going to try this, I need to know you're always coming back. I don't know. That's a pretty big promise to make. Oh, is it? I have to have something special to come back to. I'm open to suggestions. So sweet. Thank you, Shepard, for the drinks and everything. Oh, come back soon, Liara. Oh, well, now that's done. I think it's time to continue our journey. I will be visiting Lyra every now and then, but mostly doing it off screen because uh, it's not really that important stuff that you can do there. And you cannot really have more moments with Lyra. If you do, I will be saving always before and I will be showing them in some episodes. But for now, I think it's time to actually head out. See what else there is. Uh, Kelly, do you have for anything for me? Commander, you've received a new message at your private terminal. I was hoping so. Let's see, unread messages. Thank you again. Hmm. Okay, this is one of those guys that I saved in previous. Okay, previous game. Oh yeah, they are the biotics, the ones that had the old type of biotics. Mm, I kind of feel a little bit bad for Caden for having to sacrifice him, but I didn't actually like him that much, so <laughs> that was my main reason. Anyways, there's that done, and let's see. Yeah. <laughs> okay, I'm not actually that fast of reader, I just uh, gl glanced the most parts of them. If I was playing alone, I would most likely just... Uh, well, I am playing alone here, but if I was just playing for myself, I would uh, definitely just keep reading all of these. See the messages and so on. Anyways... Okay, so Talisora has been... Yes. Okay, so I have to go visit uh, Dr. Klo at some point, and I might as well do it right now, actually. I might go to the Citadel from here. Let's see. I don't know what to feel about Grunt. My psych reports were for Okir. We have no guarantees that Grunt is mentally stable. I get the feeling he just doesn't care about anything, including who lives or dies. <laughs> is there anything I should know? Garrus received some news that put fire in his eyes. Maybe you should speak with him down in the main battery. Tally seems very distraught after receiving a message. Maybe you could check in on her down in engineering. Anything else, Commander? That'll be all. I'll I think that's all. Okay, so let's uh, go talk to 
Garus went first, and then let's go talk to Tali before we head to Citadel and wrap this episode up. So, first of all, Garus should be here. Rupert, there's something different with tonight's meal. Seems like you put in more food and less ass. Yeah, yeah, keep talking. <laughs> oh, I so like my crew. Even those uh, non-important characters, I really like that they are a bit more interactive than they were in before uh, in the previous game. Shepard, I'm glad you came by. I've got something. I may need your help. You remember Sidonis, the one who betrayed my team? I found a lead on him. Oh, sounds good. There's a specialist on the Citadel, named Fade. He's an expert at helping people disappear. Sidonis was seen with him. What are you planning to do when you find him? You humans have a saying. An eye for an eye, a life for a life. He owes me ten lives, and I plan to collect. And I Where plan on Fade? helping I've you. Arranged a meeting. We'll meet him in a warehouse near the Neon Markets down on Zakara Ward. Thanks, Shepard. I appreciate you taking the time to help me. You're welcome. I was planning to go to the Citadel anyways, so I guess this is one of the things that I will be taking part of. I don't know if there's anything that Dr. Chakwas will have to do, say. Commander, I very much enjoyed sharing that ice brandy with you. But I hope I wasn't too unprofessional. Brandy goes straight to my head. It's nice to see you let your hair down. Well, promise me we'll share a bottle every year. The next one is on me. Hmm. Sounds good. So let's go find Tali. Down into elevators. Too bad that there is no elevator music in this game. <laughs> um, I didn't actually hate the elevators uh, in the uh, first uh, Mass Effect. A lot of people. Oh, you know we've got a crazy woman squatting down in the sub deck. What? If she touches anything, I'll kill her. Oh, and the only thing she wears from her waist up is tattoos. Oh, maybe I should go down and welcome her aboard. And she's a murderer. Has biotic powers that could crush you with a blink. Hates everyone in Cerberus. Damn it, girl. Stop <laughs> toying with me. <laughs> oh, God. Shepard, so. I'm glad you came by. Yes. I may need your help. I just received a message from the migrant fleet. The Admiralty Board has accused me of treason. Oh, I'm scared, okay. Shepard. Nobody who knows you could believe you'd betray your people, Tally. I don't know. They don't lay charges like this unless the evidence seems absolute. But thanks. I appreciate your faith in me, Shepard. What happens when a Quarian is accused of treason? There's a hearing, with members of the Admiralty Board acting as judges. My father is an Admiral on the board. He'll have to recuse himself from judgment. I can't even imagine what he's thinking right now. The punishment for treason is exile. If they convict me, I can never go back. So you have no idea why they're accusing you? None. The specifics of charges like this are rarely discussed on open channels. I won't know any more until I get to the flotilla. What happens if you're convicted? Like I said, exile. The specifics are up to the judges. If it's deemed only a tragic mistake in judgment, the guilty party might receive a small ship and supplies. Not that it really matters. Either way, if I'm convicted, I'll never see the migrant fleet again. <sighs> okay, let's go find the flotilla. I was going to book passage on another ship. I didn't think there would be time for you to help. Thank you, Shepard. Of course I will I'll help you, Tali. Normandy with the flotilla's current location. The admirals will be waiting for us. Did you seriously think that I wouldn't be helping you? One of the dearest friends of mine. <sighs> You're so wrong there. Uh, let's go... See, I uh, don't think Grant has anything to say though. Have time now, Shepard. 
I want... I need to deal with this. I'm listening. What's the issue? Something is wrong, Shepard. I feel wrong. Tense. I just want to kill something. With my hands. More so than usual. Like it's not my choice. Like I just want to... I don't know. I have See, done this before. Why do that? What's wrong? Okir didn't imprint. I'm tank born. What is this? Don't know if I can Most help. Off war. I won't ask. Joker can get Thank us to the shepherd. Yeah, I had that already. Anyways. Oh yeah, I haven't talked to Joker for a while. Let's see how he's doing. I mean come on out. Uh, uh, the fact is that uh, uh, that Kelly won't actually tell you if Joker has something to say so you have to go check on him yourself and I've Eddie of course in three months. I can't wait we're flying into the eye of the storm and you're thinking about some Asari prostitute hey watch it it's not like that at all she's so she's uh, you won't understand unless you meet her <laughs> oh god these two as well I like how there is uh, stuff like that all over this ship. Commander. I assume everything's going well up here? It was until the thing started questioning my every move. It won't let anything slide. You were deliberately falsifying maintenance reports, Mr. Moreau. Not falsifying, tweaking. I always round up on task times. It makes us look good when we come in under. Harmless self-promotion. Edie can ease off on that. Very well, Shepard. Yeah. Go pout. I win. Joker. Right, right. No hard feelings. Good game. That's it for now. See you, Commander. Okay. So, let's uh, get back to the Citadel. Let's go talk to the Dr. Chloe. Could you stop looking down, please? <laughs> Why are you so sad always when you look forward? Or when you run forward? No messages for you, Commander. Oh, there shouldn't be any new messages at this point. <laughs> Anyways, let's see, let's see. I have to get out from here. Um, I guess it's here. Oh, there is mass relay. If I was actually uh, playing on my own, I would have checked that other system near those. Near the Shadow Broker base, but for now let's go. Oh, there is Ezra Ridge Planet and so on, and there is a lot of other Ridge Planets there, but for now let's go to the Citadel. Dr. Chloe is, Chloe is waiting for me, but after that I think I will be doing them. Yeah, if you if you're not interested in this but want to see me just uh, going help Kairos, I will be doing that in the next episode. But in this one, I will just uh, check the Doctor Glow and then check some of the shops. So if you're not interested in stuff like that, you can just uh, skip ahead to the next episode. But I also want to open a uh, uh, something to drink here. Let's open a ginger ale from. Canada. I love some important stuff. So good. It's something that we don't actually have commonly here in Finland, the ginger ale, but uh, there is every now and then places you can find some, uh, like I said, important stuff. Imported. Let's see. Let's have Garus with us, of course. And let's have. I'd say Tali. Tali will be in most of my missions with me. As you might have guessed. Uh, I'll save for that one. Um, yeah, I'll take that one. And as for Garrus, I think I should go for a conclusive shot, maybe. 
Yeah. Hmm. Yep. Let's take that. And on the next uh, time, because I want some anti-personal personal people with me, as uh, Tali is the more of the person who takes down the heavy heavy robots and controls them. I found references to a forger named Fade in CSEC crime reports, Shepard. Perhaps that is a good place to start looking. Okay. Um. So I wouldn't want to do it right now. Let's see, rapid transfer. Uh, Citadel. I guess I'll have to just uh, search the shops and so on to find find the Doctor Club. What? What? <laughs> Jeez. And by the way, that's oh oh god. Oh, there's the another data pad. Thank you. What? Welcome to Sarinus Apple. Do I know you? No, but I know you. Even a senile Hanar would remember the human who fought off the Geth. I thought you were dead. Yeah, I've been getting that a lot. Please, look around the store. It's a pleasure to have you here. You know, I use quite a bit of software in my line of work. It's a shame so few understand their own equipment. Besides the most obvious point and go nav interfaces anyway. You wouldn't believe how often I hear, why is the ship turning around? We're only halfway there. <laughs> oh, I would. You know, I like your products. Any interest in an endorsement from the human who defeated Saren? I'd be thrilled. But I don't think I could afford to pay you for it. Don't worry about it. What if we just work out a discount? Absolutely. Just speaking to my console here. I'm Commander Shepard, and this is my favorite store in the Citadel. Oh, that God. will be splendid. I can edit that and have it working right away. Thank you so much. Oh, God. Now, how many of these shops actually have that already? Let's see. Damage protection. Yep. Definitely want it. I can use this. And take damage. Yes, for Itali. Good stuff. I think there's other part of that sh uh, part of that shop. So oh, I kind of want to scan these guys. <laughs> what do you think, Michael? Maybe the immunoboost. Good day, citizen. Welcome to the Serta Foundation Outlet on Zakira Ward. <laughs> I couldn't help but notice your prices. They seem a bit steep. With respect, the Foundation is not concerned with profits. A portion of our sales funds research to cure genetic diseases. You know, it would make your services more popular. An endorsement from the woman who defeated Saren. Oh my! You're a shepherd, aren't you? I would be glad to give you my employee discount if you would do that for us. It's a deal. Just speak into my console here. <laughs> I'm Commander Shepard, and this is my favorite store on the Citadel. I'll work it into our advertising at once. Thank you. God. Uh, let's see. Increases health by, yes, 10% definitely good, and also medical capacity. This might be useful. In case I need. I mean, the medical is right now much more useful than how it was before. This looks like the place. The forger's thug should be inside. Oh. Oh. Well, that will that we will leave for the next episode. So, until then, until then.